Alvin enters. Thunder he hears. <laughs> Two people lost that sea ship with Stefano. Stefano approaches. He sees four legs coming out of a cloak. He thinks it's a monster. Is it? He then realizes that it's Trinculo from the boat. They ended up on the same island. Caliban, Trinculo, and Stefano end up joining forces. They become close, and then they make Caliban drunk. And Caliban, they take advantage of. Caliban decides to have a new master, which is Stefano. And now he shows them the island. Here we go. Trinculo knew Stefano before the scene. He acts very antagonistic and looks down upon Caliban throughout the scene and looks at him as a monster and very ignorant. Calvin in this scene is threatened by Trinculo. He believes Prospero sent him to be a spirit and to torment Caliban. Throughout the scene, Trinculo and Stefan decided to take advantage of this ignorant monster. They give him drinks and get him drunk, a drunken fool. And then he decides to show them the island. But also, Caliban wants to get away from Prospero. He wants a new master. He wants freedom. But he decides to go under Stefano's spell and to be, have Stefano be his new master. But now, Calvin is drunk and shows him thy island and also has a new master. No freedom yet. Stefano, a butler and a very close friend of Trinculo, enters the scene as being very drunk. He then tells Calvin just to drink a little bit, but then Calvin drinks a lot. Also, Calvin then promises to show them the island later on, and he also promises to become Stefano's new personal slave. 